And now, NBC 38's Business Spotlight. Hey y'all, Raven here from Raven in Real Life and this is NBC 38 Business Spotlight. And today the spotlight is on Life South Blood Donation Centers. And I'm actually standing right here with Sharon Carp Carpenter of Life South. So can you tell us a little bit about your company and your mission? Sure, um, we are a community blood center, which means we um, give local, save local. Uh, we take blood donations here in Columbus and we serve the St. Francis um, Hospital. Uh, so all of the blood that's donated here in Columbus will stay here for the local hospital. Okay, and you guys are actually their sole provider, correct? Yes, um, that is correct. So that means they only get their blood products from us. Um, all of the life-saving products come from Life South, straight over to St. Francis. Now you say blood products, so at this point, can't scientists just make this stuff? Unfortunately, no. That answer would be a flat no. Um, there's no way to synthetically make blood. Um, it has to come from a donor, a living donor actually. So um, we take whole blood, we also take platelets, um, and then we also take double red cells. So there are many ways that um, the community can come in and help save lives. So what is that process and how is it different with the different types of blood donation? Um, so for instance, with whole blood, it is about um, a 30 minute process that includes your physical as well as the donation process. And that takes about 10 minutes. You just get one needle, you give whole blood. That whole blood is then broken down into different parts. So you can actually save three lives when you donate whole blood. We also take platelets, which is the machine behind me here. Um, and what that does is it actually centrifuges your blood while you're donating. Um, and it will give you back some saline as well as all of your red cells. And then we keep the platelets. Um, whole blood is usually used in trauma, uh, vehicle accidents, things like that. But your platelets are really used in um, heart surgeries, open heart, and also for leukemia, cancer patients that are undergoing uh, chemotherapy. Okay, so what would you say is the best time for someone to either come in and donate or stop at one of your blood mobiles? Is it during tragedy, after a big accident? When do you guys really need people to come through? Well, we actually need people every day. Um, you can donate blood um, every 56 days, but a whole blood unit is only good for 42 days and a platelet unit is only good for seven days. Um, and we use blood on a consistent basis. So um, as a donor, I try to donate regularly because blood is needed on an everyday basis. Okay, and can someone just stop in here and can they stop anywhere that they see the blood mobile, even if it's at a business that they're not related to or affiliated with? Absolutely, um, you don't have to have an appointment to donate. You can just stop in. You see our bus all around town um, right now. We're, we're at Walmarts, we're at Columbus Park Crossing, so just stop in and donate. We're also across the street from the hospital. You guys um, heard it here, so make sure that you donate at Life South. Until next time, this is NBC 38 Business Spotlight. To see your business in the spotlight, call us at 706-561-3838.